So let's talk about potential energy. So I've got a question here which is saying an object of mass 2 kg falls from a height of 5 meters to the ground. What is the work done by the gravitational force uh, on the object? Negate air resistance and take G to be 10 meters per second squared. So they want us to find the work done. Now, in this case, the work done by the gravitational force, uh, force is the same as the potential energy. Because we know that work is equal to force times distance. Now, in a case of here, we have got an object. This object is falling. Okay? So this object has got the mass. So the gravitational force in this case is the weight of this object. Okay? So we're going to say the force is going to be mg. The mg which have been given here. So we're going to say the work is going to be mg times d. Now, the distance which we're talking about here is the height. So I'm going to replace d with the height. So we know that this is basically potential energy. So potential energy in this case is the same as the work done by the gravitational force. So in this case, they're saying, what is the work done by the gravitational force? It's the same as what is the potential energy. So the work done by the gravitational potential energy, we have got the mass 2 times g, we have been told that is 10 times 5. So work done by the gravitational force is going to be 220 times 5, which is 100. We can just say 2 times 5, 10. So 100 joules is our work done by the gravitational uh, force.